to say hello. Hello everybody and welcome to Storytime at Arlington Public Library. I'm Miss Karen and I'm here to do some stories and songs with you today uh, as we have some fun with, um, with reading and stories. So um, I want to start with my very favorite song. Uh, that it's a Rafi song, and thanks to Rafi for giving me permission to sing it with you. And uh, it has a few gestures. We say, uh, I'm in the mood for singing. That one doesn't really have a gesture. But then we say, I'm in the mood for clapping, and we can clap along. I'm in the mood for stomping. That's my favorite. We can stomp. But then I added one that says, I'm in the mood for stories. So I make my hands go like I'm reading a book, right? Okay, so here we go. I'm in the mood for singing, hey, how about you? I'm in the mood for singing, hey, how about you? I'm in the mood for singing, singing along with you. Hey, hey, what do you say? I'm in the mood for that today. Hey, hey, what do you say? I'm in the mood for that. I'm in the mood for clapping. Hey, how about you? I'm in the mood for clapping. Hey, how about you? I'm in the mood for clapping, clapping along with you. Hey, hey, what do you say? I'm in the mood for that today. Hey, hey, what do you say? I'm in the mood for that. I'm in the mood for stomping. Hey, how about you? I'm in the mood for stomping. Hey, how about you? I'm in the mood for stomping, stomping along with you. Hey, hey, what do you say? I'm in the mood for that today. Hey, hey, what do you say? I'm in the mood for that. I'm in the mood for stories, hey, how about you? I'm in the mood for stories, hey, how about you? I'm in the mood for stories, stories to share with you. Hey, hey, what do you say? I'm in the mood for that today. Hey, hey, what do you say? I'm in the mood for that. Thank you for singing along with me. So, as always, I really am in the mood for stories. I kind of always am, but I love stories. And today I'm going to do some stories with you um, and do some things having to do with gardens. Because here we are in the summertime and gardens are growing big. And I have some books here about gardens. I'm going to show you a way you can make your hands bloom like a flower. It's pretty fun. It's quite simple. I'll go through it a couple times so you can try it. Ready? So we have, here is a green leaf, and here is a green leaf. That, you see, makes two. Here is a bud. That makes it a flower. Watch it bloom for you. There, see, it blooms like a flower. Right, so we have a green leaf and a green leaf, which makes two leaves, right? Then we have the bud, and we watch it bloom. Okay, so let's try it one more time, ready? Here is a green leaf, and here is a green leaf. That, you see, makes two. Here is a bud. That makes it a flower. Watch it bloom for you. Hey, very nice job. So, <laughs> excuse me, I also have, um, was thinking about how in gardens, in addition to flowers and things that we can eat, depending on your kind of garden, there's other things in a garden too, right? Sometimes if you are in a garden and you listen, you can hear all kinds of other things. So I have a little uh, flannel board rhyme, and I want you to see if you can guess the thing I'm talking about based on the noise it makes. Ready? There's something in my garden. Now what can it be? There's something in my garden that I can't really see. 
hear its funny sound? Ribbit, ribbit. Can you guess what it is? Yeah, that's right, it's a frog. Ribbit, I've got a frog hiding somewhere in my garden. Yeah. Okay, let's see, I think I have some more things. There's something in my garden. Now, what can it be? There's something in my garden that I can't really see. I hear its funny sound. Bzzz, bzzz. Can you guess what it is? A bee is what I found. Bzzz. All right, so I've got a frog in my garden and a bee in my garden. Let's see what else something in my garden. Now, what can it be? There's something in my garden that I can't really see. I hear its funny sound. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Can you think of something little that wiggles? A caterpillar I found. Yeah, my caterpillar's orange. All right, let's see, I think I have a couple more things. There's something in my garden. Now, what can it be? There's something in my garden that I can't really see. I hear its funny sound. Flutter, flutter, flutter. What can it be, can you guess? A butterfly is what I found. Yeah, a butterfly. All right, and I've got one more. There's something in my garden. Now, what can it be? There's something in my garden that I can't really see. I hear its funny sound. Tweet, tweet, tweet. A bird is what I found. This one's not actually a felt. It's going to sit right up here. Here's my bird. Yeah. Well, so those are the stories and songs I had to do with you today. I hope that you had fun and that you're thinking about growing things. If you grow things yourself or just see all the wonderful things that are growing around you, you can see lots of different kinds of things. You can also read about them. I have some examples here. Like I said at the beginning, these are all books about gardens and growing things. And if you wanted to get some of those at home, you could go on the computer and go to uh, our website, library.arlingtonva.us, and request a book to be placed on hold and then come to Central Library and pick it up when it's ready for you. And we also have a, a lot of digital things. That, those are the things that you can read on the screen or listen to the audio books. So you could um, download some of those too. So we hope we can see you at the library, but uh, for now I'm going to do the goodbye song, and it's just like the hello song I did at the beginning. At the beginning, remember we said hello, friends, and friends, I'm going to show it to you this time, I didn't before, we've got one friend and another friend, it's like they hug each other, like that, one way and the other way. But this time, instead of hello, that's hello, right, we're going to say goodbye, okay? Goodbye, friends. Goodbye, friends. Goodbye, friends. It's time to say goodbye. Bye, everyone.